Today we'll be learning the chorus, the instrumental interlude, and the bridge for Colin Baton Rouge by Garth Brooks. So for the chorus, the whole thing is on an open D chord. We'll play our open D and our open A. We might change up the rhythm of the bow strokes just a little bit, but it sounds like this. And then for this instrumental interlude, we are going to play a G chord for two measures and an A chord for one measure. So for a G chord, we're going to do our open D and our first finger on the A string. So it sounds like that. And it'll sound like this for two measures. And then we do our A chord for just one measure. That's our first finger on the D string and our open A. because it's only three measures on those instrumental interludes instead of what we would typically do as four. Okay, for this bridge part, for the first two lines, we are going to play three chords and then a walk up to the next chord. So we start with a D chord and then an A chord, our B minor chord, and then our walk up is going to be with our open D and on the A string we're going to walk up course that's going to lead to that high D with the open D. And that is the first chord of the second line. So the first line sounds like this. And then the first chord of the next line is that D. And then to your A, B minor again. And then this time we are going to do open and walk up the D string which of course is going to lead to this G. That's going to be the first chord of the next line, so let's try the second line. And then we'll get ready for that G to start the third line. That G. Until then I'll spend my... Then an A. Money up front. Then D. Back to your intro. 